this is all two D two figures from the uh, Star Wars: The Clone Wars figure line, and uh, he comes in the 2010 packaging. Uh, feature the Galactic Battle game. So this one comes with a Galactic Battle game card with a picture of R two D two, and you can fight against each other at the roll of a die. So that's that, and there's also come a special offer for an exclusive battle game mat and Sergeant Brick figure. Uh, in the back show the uh, it show that this figure come with hidden gadgets and uh, thrusters and hook and cable. Very cool. Uh, also figures um, uh, release is the Jungle Camel Off Trooper, Kia the Mundi Flamethrower. Uh, clone Trooper, which is a repaint of Captain Wreck, and uh, Clone Pilot Gold Chise. So that's that. Uh, so here's R2D2. Uh, uh, not a bad looking R2D2. Uh, this is the second R2D2 that I have. First one is uh, the first one I have is the electronic uh, R2D2 from uh, the Revenge of the Sith with the electronic lights and sound so uh, but not a lot of differences between the two um, so yeah well the only differences is uh, this one head can swivel and to show up the uh, feature this one come with two thruster. Yeah, you can attach them to his side arm uh, to make him hover or fly, something like that. And he has a removable middle tread or wheel. Uh, I wish this one has a hinge so you can tilt it or something, but it's just a pure plastic and rolling wheel at the bottom. Uh, in the front, he has these two opening panel that uh, reveal hidden gadgets. And. Uh, you can see this one is a clam and this one I believe is some sort of plug or connector something like that and on the back uh, if you open this uh, panel there is a hook inside but it's very difficult to get out well when I do this it's easy and uh, there is no button for you to uh, retract the cable or extend it, or, or well, all you have to do is uh, swivel his head. Um, if you want the cable to come out, swivel his uh, his head counterclockwise, and yes, the cable come out. Very cool. The cable is made of a rope material, and there's a hook at the end, just like in the show. So that's cool, and you can retract it by turning his head clockwise man I wish there would be some sort of button for faster um, retraction just like on the on, on the Pursuit of Cobra um, Recondo figure I guess well he has a backpack that has a button so that I think that's kinda cool and uh, if it wasn't for the for the picture on the back of the packaging I wouldn't know this is that as you can see he has a uh, pop up eye or, or some sort and here it is so yeah you can uh, use your nail and this is the eye that pops up uh, nothing really cool yeah, well just for display purpose and so yeah and these two you can put it back and close it so yeah f so uh, figure has wheels at the bottom so uh, you can roll him roll very well and uh, compared to uh, the uh, legacy collection this one is a little bit shorter uh, but but the hidden gadget is really a plus for me that's why I bought this figure in the first place it, uh, come with a uh, thruster pop up eye cable and rolling very cool uh, especially if you uh, didn't have him before and here is uh, Anakin Skywalker 
the uh, perfect uh, pairs of the Star Wars Legacy. So yes, and if you have uh, Anakin Starfighter, uh, it's good to buy Anakin and uh, R2D2 so you can fit him in, in into his Starfighter. So that's 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 pretty awesome. If you are a fan of the Clone War, uh, I mean, if you are if you are a fan of the uh, of Star Wars in general, uh, in general, you would love to get this pair. Uh, I mean, who who would know about uh, Anakin and R two D two, right? So, yeah, very cool figure uh, to display next to Anakin Skywalker. Come with very cool gadgets and gears. So I highly recommend it. Check out your local uh, Toys R Us, Target, maybe Walmart. Um, so go out and buy this guy. He will cost you about uh, seven or eight dollars, but I think it is a uh, worthy uh, purchase. So I highly recommend this figure. This is the Clone Wars R2D2, and thanks for watching.